Thanks, Brian. Ontario Sport Network launched the This Is Your Sport campaign to help redefine and broaden the definition of what sport and recreation can be so that all Ontarians can benefit from a healthy, active lifestyle. To tell us more is Miranda Iam, who is the This Is Your Sport ambassador. Good morning, Miranda. How are you? I'm great, Kelly. How are you doing? Good, thank you. So first off, tell us more about the Ontario Sport Network. Yeah, the Ontario Sport Network is a not-for-profit organization really looking to promote sport and recreation in Canada, really with the mission to create active, unified, and really healthy communities and a province as, as a larger extension of that. So, Miranda, tell us about This Is Your Sport campaign. What's that all about? Yeah, so the This Is Your Sport campaign was meaning to broaden our perception of sport because often we have a really narrow perception of what that is. I know in my life as an Olympian, it was sweating on the floor and going back and forth, but it's so much more than that. It can be skateboarding, going out for a hike, connecting with people in your community center. It's really about that recreational and connection piece as well and discovering what being active and healthy looks like to each individual. And, you know, Miranda, for in your own life, what are some things outside of the regular sport that you enjoy doing? Well, now that I'm retired, I have completely transitioned what movement looks like for me. Thankfully, I'm, I'm blessed to be right in front of a park here in London, Ontario, so I get out regularly regularly just to be out in nature and walk and move my body. Um, I also like to connect with um, my parents or friends doing the same thing. I also like to do a little bit of yoga, just low impact, but still moving my body in a great way that feels good to me. Yeah, so how are we going to see this campaign roll out? How are uh, Ontarians going to be notified about this? Well, the campaign has already been going on and we already have some great um, feedback from Ontarians and their perception being changed or shifted and creating that awareness piece around what is available to them. OSN has a great activity finder. You can go to their website and you just scroll down to the bottom. And what's great about that is that you can find and discover new sports that you might not have thought about before. And you can filter the options around uh, low impact, um, financially available, like w whether it requires equipment, um, so many different options that you can play around with and explore something new. And we found as a result of the campaign that before the campaign, the biggest barrier was really accessibility, whether that's physical, financial, or people just thinking like, there's not a space for me. But now after the uh, campaign has been launched, we've seen that number drop from 75 to 66. People are really shifting their patterns. After the campaign, about 85 Ontarians that were contacted or aware of this campaign are now taking action as a result of it. So really exciting results and shifting Ontarians back in into sport and recreation. And Miranda, just quickly, how did you get involved with this? Well, the Ontario Sport, Ontario sport Network is a great um, uh, organization and something that's near and dear to me as, as sport and recreation is something I've been doing my entire life. And when I had the opportunity to align with them as an ambassador, that was a, a no-brainer. Awesome. And how can people get involved just quickly? easy uh, to go to ontariosportnetwork.ca um, and learn more about it. Go to the Activity Finder, sign up at your community center, whether that's just to get involved with sport or volunteer as someone who's helping out and help out and connect with your community members there. Amazing, Amanda. Thank, uh, Miranda, thank you so much for joining us. We'll have all the details on chch.com. Thank you.